Here we go. First fight on before the bell this evening. Like I say, the first of the Reese brothers in action. Owen, one and over as a professional. Very aggressive. Very exciting. I've been told Barry one to watch. He's come out with all kinds of plays already, hasn't he, David? Good structure to his work here, Reese. Again, just dipping the legs there as well, making Cheskovsky miss there with his follow up attacks. Good body shot as well there from Reese. Very aggressive. Good start from Owen Reese on the front foot. That, looking to that big bombs. He said he was going to do this at the press conference on Thursday. That's what the combination is the second of the day. So a left uppercut, then followed it with the same hand there. Whacking on the body with the left hook. Credit to Tchaikovsky. He's there, but he took a big left hook, though, from Owen Reese. Who looks to follow that up with a one-two. Trying to play it back, though, isn't he, Tchaikovsky? You've got to give him his credit. Yeah, he's game Tchaikovsky. I've seen him. In the build-up to, to this fight, watching some of his fights, he, he's aggressive himself. Does leave lots of openings though when he lets his shots go. You can see the chin's higher off the pole. Tension a little bit too far out there, Reese. That's a nice left foot there though. Just before that, he's going to get his feet a little bit closer. I was talking to Owen Reese at the press conference and when I mentioned what Eddie Hearn had said at the Lenara's Catchall press conference, and he wants all his fights to entertain and excite. Sort of looked to me, give me a little smile to say that's exactly how I'd fight. So. <laughs> Really eager to get going and impress good the shot. local fans. That yeah, was a good shot. Do you know what? He's been nice and aggressive. He just slowed down just a little bit because he's neat with his work. Again, he dips his legs all there, so he's, you know, he comes back up with a nice left foot to the body. Yeah, good variation, changing the levels well. Head, body, the left of the body worked well. Good amateur. Secured his spate, spot. Sorry on the Team GB. Eight amateur fights, one around 70. Working well here, head and body buried. Yeah, the left hooks have been, been the close from in this one, isn't it, for sure. What he did quite well is the second row as well. When he was in close, he just used his arms and his forearms. Just a block shot. He didn't. Just a good shot. That was beautiful. He took his head off the line on the outside of the jab of Tchaikovsky and he threw the right hand. It was a lovely shot. The pole doing the right thing, he's holding, trying to smother the work of Owen Reese. Yeah, well timed right hand as well there. Slotted the left hand from Kochowski and he made him pay. Into the last 10 seconds of the opening round, it's been a very good, fast start from Owen Reese. Done exactly what he said he was going to do. Credit to the pole, he's taken some big shots, but he's still standing. there from Owen Reese Barry. Frantic pace, wasn't it? But it was a frantic pace because he picked his shots really well. Those right hands over the lazy jab there of Tchaikovsky. Just there, it's the perfect timing there for that. And the left hook to the body and head was fantastic there from Reese. Almost jogs out to the centre of the ring for the start of the second round. Again, looking to land big bombs. Credit to Tchaikovsky. Trying to land shots of his own. It's just that chin very high of the pole. Carries that right hand a little low as well when he throws his left hook. He's open to the shots and Reese looking for that shot, Barry. But what he does, Coach Hoshi, the, the, the jab's too tight. The people don't realise this. It's how fast it comes out, how fast it comes back. So he throws it out at a decent speed, but it comes back too slow. And Reese has found that out very early. So he, every time he throws a, a jab, he just fires the right hand, follows it back, and it gets there before before the left hand does. Yeah, 
from the city of Lublin, about 100 miles away from Warsaw. And you can see his game comes to win. Did you research on me, mate? Yeah, yeah. an effort. Big, big, uh, an effort big this fan week. of my geography, yeah. Harry. And your jokes about my height, I didn't know. I forgot about that. <laughs> oh, Owen well, Reese on the front foot, he backs. Tchaikovsky into that blue corner, letting big shots go to pole. Been quite crafty in his defence. It's a smother the work of Reese. And game as well. Yeah, he's very game. I mean, that's, I mean, that's, that's a lovely effort there from Reese. I mean, the gap should appear because he is throwing, but I think it's also, I think that's keeping him in the fight. He's not being overwhelmed. Yeah, good pressure, doing the right thing there. Reese just taking a little step back, allowing space. Easy to smother your work when you let your shots go back. I'm not going to tip his legs for the right hand straight, right on the belly, right in the middle. Just sit down, nice straight right right hand. Yeah, he's got tall frame. Tchaikovsky, so the body is there to be worked. Right Trent into the pole, yeah, he's working away, he's standing in front of Reese. I think the, the local man's going to mind that though. I'm going to go searching for for Tchaikovsky. And also, when he throws that right hand Reese over the, over the jab, just take the head over to the left, just use, use that weight of your head. Just to transfer a bit more power into the shot. Yeah, heating up into a nice contest, this, but so in Reese, looking the, the stronger still, the aggressor. Oh, another good right hand, he took that well. Tarkovsky almost landed a right hand of his own. Took that flush as well, didn't he? That's he really did, he's yeah. basically done what you said, Barry. He, he took that head off the line, he slipped on the outside and threw the right hand, looking for the shot again, looking a little ragged. Uh, Tchaikovsky taking some big shots. Again, doing the right thing, holding, but looking very good Owen Reese here. Yeah, there. Relentless pressure, but and he, and he maybe he's getting a little bit smothered in his work, just a little bit. But I think the, his, the way he's picking the shots is, is really, really good for such a high pace. Oh, another right hand from Owen Reese. Another good round. Tchaikovsky, shout out, gave me his putt. Wow, he's under pressure. Six-rounder, first six-rounder for Owen Reese. Oh, that is good. Right hands again at the start of this round. Coming out, no nonsense as he has the first two rounds. A lot of the, the birdie boys naturally aggressive, and you can see it with Owen Reese again trying to land that left hook. Naturally aggressive, but the technique's good. I, I mean, you're gonna if you're gonna be as aggressive as as, as aggressive as this, you're gonna take punches. It's inevitable. It's impossible not to. But he is trying to dip his legs with the after the first shot. So he's trying to move out three punches. And also he's picking his shots. Good work. Really letting the shots go. Freeze and fours now. Going through the gears over Reese. Bit of head hunting here though. Needs to target that body of Tchaikovsky. So tough on Tchaikovsky. He really is trying to hold on, do what he can, and even try and land shots of his own under pressure. You know what I mean? You know, when he's landed, when. Good shot from Reese. When Reese lands with a couple of concussive shots, the referee can step in. But shots, he's looking to fire back. Yeah, look now, the third round. Two questions. Can Owen Reese sustain this sort of pressure I thought for the remainder of the fight? And can Tchaikovsky deal with this kind of pressure for the remainder of the fight? I thought that about Reese after the first round. I thought he can't keep this up. Relentless. Work again. Again, just smothering his work. Needs to use his feet. Great four angles, but relentless attack. Good work, the body shots. See, he gets close to the space, doesn't he? 
Can he can he can he can he can Talking to the boys again at the press conference about sparring and they're all in there with each other. Callum French, Mark Dickinson, Ben Owen. Tremendous talent in that gym, like you say, Barry Land, another left hook inside Owen Reese. He can't start taking it at all, have not These left hooks. Oh, he just missed for that one there. Reese loading up. Again, we see you're right when he's ticks that and take that head over to the left now when he throws that right hand over the top. Well, I think we've seen enough to know, Barry. Whenever we see Owen Reese in the future, yeah. we're going to see entertaining fights as he goes through the gears again. Three unanswered left hooks. Oh, it's a big shot again. He took that well, Tchaikovsky. And that's the first time he looked in trouble there, wasn't it, Tchaikovsky? God, that was a big shot, Barry, that left hook. Again, looking at that right hand, avoiding that shot, the pole, but very, very good shot selection, power, picking from Reese as he goes for that right hand again. Every single time you think Tchaikovsky is hurt and down and out, he keeps firing back, credit to the pole. Incredible resilience. Well, another brilliant round for Ryan Reese there. Again, another frantic run there from, from Owen Reese. Just non stop action, but he, he landed with about three left hooks on the spin there, and there was a real meaty one in there as well. And Kojowski's just showing a, a real resilience because some of these shots, even if they're not concussive, knock you to the floor shots, they break your, they break your heart sort of punch down there. You know, those long right hands when you're throwing a shot, he's making you miss and making you pay with a, with a weighty shot. But, and the left hooks of the body, all these punches are there to set you up to, to fail. Well, some familiar faces, Tony Sims and uh, the Connor Ben in the changing room supporting Jimmy Sainz. Teammates, of course, they've sparred with each other. All smiles, and relaxing there. It's been a brilliant start to before the bell and so much more to look forward to. Jimmy Sainz up next, but back to this contest. Owen Reese again as he has for the first three fights on the front foot and letting big shots go. Oh, a nice change of levels there, Barry. Can't miss with that right hand if he's only got to go. You, you, you want to be saying, oh, you should be doing this, you should be doing that, but I, I just, I think it's almost pointless because I think his mindset is, I'm just going to, I'm right at you, I'm just going to work you, I'll work, hustle you, hustle you. It's almost his body language as well, isn't it? You've set that tone now. To then step back and then give your sort of the, the, your opponent a full sense of security, almost. But it does allow them to get a foothold into the contest, yeah. and he's not allowing him to. No, but he can, you know, he, when, he, when he gets him on the ropes and he's throwing the shots, he can still be aggressive. He just take a little step to the, to the left, a little pivot to the left, or a step to the right, get a different angle of attack. But I think he's so mindset on, on just just trying to run right through you that I don't think he'll think that. But he's still, I have to say though, he still has that, that thought of mind to pick his shots. I think no, he's not just swinging punches all over the place, it's still, his work is still neat. Yeah, changing the levels with the shots, working head and body, really close to Tchaikovsky, who's the taller, has the longer reach, but he's nullifying the work of Tchaikovsky by getting on the chest. Sometimes, yes, smothering the work, but looking physically very strong. But again, you have to say, the pole, Tchaikovsky showing his resilience, his will to win, his desire, still let the shots go. The pace slight, slightly dipped in this fourth round. You can understand. Is, like I say, Reese's first six rounder. Really nice left hook, the right hand of Tchaikovsky low. The shots are really slowed down of Tchaikovsky. Lots of gaps in the defense. He needs to give himself some space here, Reese. Let four shots go, all taken on the, the gloves of Tchaikovsky. It looks like there's some yeah. blood there to the left eye of Owen Reese. Tchaikovsky is just always fighting back. I don't feel like there's much weight on the punches, nothing to worry about, but it's just getting just frustration might seep in. Showing a good chin, takes another stiff jab there from Reese. Oh, nice right hand. The referee's having a look. 
don't think he wants to see Tchaikovsky taking too many more of these. Though he's still in there, he's still in Chotsko. He's the one who's shipping the bigger, harder shots. Yeah, to be fair, no. Some of these shots, no, you can see he's feeling them, but there was only one shot in the last round that he looked hurt. Apart from that, he's absorbed everything here. Have a grueling round from these two. Owen Reese, the aggressor on the front foot. He looks to me, Tchaikovsky, is, as if he is fading. The referee goes over to the corner just to check, I think. The corner on the phone here, Tchaikovsky's corner. <laughs> Maybe he's not paid his uh, gas and electric bill. That's madness, that is. I've never seen that before. <laughs> is it even allowed? I don't know. It's a valid point, I don't know. No, no, Why wouldn't it be? No one's saying anything. Just hope he paid that bill on time. Let's see if we can see where that cut was caused for Owen Reese. Their heads are very close together there, Barry. Yeah, they are constantly, and he's always one coming forward. Can't they really tell, they might have been there. Oh yeah, well, there was no blood when he went in, but there's blood when he came out, so... Yeah, that's heads all inside of the glove there, that's caused that for Owen Reese. Went to round five we go. It's been an entertaining contest. Owen Reese just relentless non-stop pressure and the resilience from Tchaikovsky has been very evident, but looking jaded and deje uh, dejected in that red corner in the break as the coach was on the, the phone. Another right hand from Owen Reese. Big shot, the chin way too high of the pole, but he's standing in front of Owen Reese trying to land shots of his own. That was oh, better. Yeah, it didn't quite come off as right idea, wasn't it? A little half a step back. To be fair to me, so he's got a little cut. I think that's something he's going to The way he fights, I think that's something he's going to get used to. And you can't be this aggressive and not come up with any marks or scrapes. Yeah, hopefully that cut's not too bad. Like all these young fighters, they want to be busy, they want to be active, so they don't want to cut to, to hold you back and stop that momentum. Because he looks like he can bang here. He's going to be interesting if he really can because Kraychowski has got a fantastic chin, which I think he's got a decent chin guaranteed, but the other guy got an ironclad chin. Or Reese doesn't hit, hit as hard as, as it seems. Either way, though, I think just the relentless pressure would, would break the spirit, you would feel. Oh. Find the target there, Owen Reese, but again. Tchaikovsky taking the shots, still trying to fire back, but they're sloppy, they're slow shots now. Wide open to the counter. Tchaikovsky. He's looking to give himself space now, isn't he, Barry? I think, I think that's what he needs there. If he can have a sustained attack where, where Kaczowski doesn't throw back, and I the think the referee looking, has to step in. Yeah, yeah. He's looking but right, can, Barry. But you can't stop it. He looks tired, Kaczowski. But he's not getting hurt, is he? That's the thing, you know? He's firing back. Nothing effective. He hasn't won a round, but he is firing back. Yeah, just like the, the second half of the fourth round, pace has dipped a little bit. Like you say, Barry, you can understand why it was an electric start from Warren Reese. Good body shot there from Reese. Yeah. That, that's what he does quite well. He finds, when he's close like this, he does find space. That was a big right hand, and the referee's seen it now. It was a lovely right hand. Tchaikovsky protests, he wasn't staggering, he didn't drop, but it was a lovely shot, he couldn't miss with that right hand Owen Reese. and in the end after relentless pressure, he gets the stoppage, and the home fans are delighted. Yeah, you know, he deserved the rewards for the effort he put in there, Reece. that's one of those stoppage where I don't dispute it too much, but I also would say that he could have continued, but He's taking all those punches, and but he is fighting back. He's having no success. Hasn't won a round. You have to factor in that he knows. I was, yeah, it, 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 it's a, it's a tricky one. If that's a title fight, just screaming in blue murder. But it's not, and he's and he's not winning any second in every round. So he's continued to fire back. But it was big right hands being latched out of the land continuously, and he looked tired. And even though he didn't look like he was going to go down for a second, I would say that. 
but I think you know you're watching it. The, the referee's watching this entirely of the fight, and he's just gone. That's one too heavy right hand, too many for his liking. So I understand the, the reasons why, but I can understand why Tchaikovsky also had a little bit of a, a dispute with the referee about it. He didn't scream about it, but he thought I could have carried on there, mate. And he could have, but he would have just took more punishment. Exactly, he was never going to win the fight, was he? Too tough for his own good, really. His chin was high. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dean Wilson calls a halt to this contest. The official time of the stoppage, two minutes and 25 seconds of round number five. Declaring your winner by TKO. He's still undefeated. Owen.